Prosecutors have dropped dozens of cases in recent months after a Sun Sentinel investigation revealed people in felony mental health court were spending six times longer there than in regular court. I've seen more of a willingness for the parties, the public defender's office and the state attorney's office, uh, to work together uh, to review cases, in particular the more nonviolent felonies, uh, for consideration of early dismissal. When the doctor declared 51-year-old Deborah Tomasello incompetent, she began her journey through felony mental health court. Was put in jail, and then I was put in a program by Judge Spicer called Stepping Stones. I did finish the program nine months, and when I was let out of the program, I was put into a halfway house. Tomasello's life was good. She had a good job, a plush condo in Lighthouse Point, and family around her. But after her father's death in 2004, she succumbed to a depression so devastating, she says she lost control of her life. The depression, you could just feel the depression in the house. Or you could just feel it. I think that's when the mental illness kicked in. I never really knew how sick I was. In 2011, Tomasello, a sales representative, was accused of using customer credit card information to pay for $6,000 in Publix gift cards, a nearly $800 puppy, and more than $190 in cigarettes, among other items. There are some cases like hers, but there are also some people that come into the system, get treatment, resolve their cases, and we don't, we don't see them again. Not everybody is like Ms. Tomasello, but the ones like Ms. Tomasello, we need to address and divert and possibly encourage the state attorney's office and defense counsel uh, to work toward an early dismissal. On March 16th, after spending nearly five years in mental health court, prosecutors dropped Tomasello's charges. What this meant for me is that, um, I, I, that I, I did what I set out to do Okay, I wanted to finish the five years, and um, I wanted to be good. For SunSentinel.com, I'm Amy Beth Bennett.